Dear traders, you're watching the latest economic calendar on Insta TV with me, Anna Kasatkina. Early next week, all eyes will be turned to the following macroeconomic events. On Monday, the IFO Institute will publish October report on business climate in Germany. Experts suppose that in October the indicator slid to 108 points. In September, the IFO Institute reported that Germany's business climate index showed an unexpected growth. Thus, in the previous month, the indicator advanced to 108.5 points from 108.4 points in August. However, economies had expected a decline to 108 points in the given period. In September, the current assessment index dropped, whereas the indicator of economic expectations rose. On Tuesday, the UK will release preliminary GDP data for the third quarter. It is expected that the country's economy grew by 0.6%, compared to a 2.4% rise in the previous quarter. In the second quarter, the indicator climbed by 0.7%, compared to the previous three months. Besides, GDP increased by 2.4% compared to the second quarter of 2014. Both indicators met the preliminary estimates of experts. The country's GDP was mostly boosted by the export sector. Compared to the first quarter, exports gained 3.9%. Moreover, on Wednesday, the Fed will announce the most expected decision on the key interest rate. Analysts do not forecast any surprises. They suppose that the benchmark interest rate will be in the range 0 to quarter percent per annum. At the previous meeting, the Fed took the same decision and kept the interest rate unchanged at the level announced in 2009. Economists participating in the survey have different opinions of the key interest rate hike in September. In general, markets did not expect any changes at the beginning of the autumn. However, the Fed did not show any signals which could exclude the rate increase till the end of the year. At the same time, the U.S. Central Bank cut a long-term forecast of the interest rate hike. Besides, the curve of the key interest rate rises will be smoother than the previously thought. Besides, the following statistics is due for release early next week. On Monday, the U.S. will report on new home sales. On Tuesday, New Zealand will reveal the trade balance data. And the U.S. will comment on durable goods orders and the Consumer Confidence Index. On Wednesday, Australia will publish data on the Consumer Prices Index. And this concludes the calendar of the latest financial events prepared for you by Insta TV team. Thank you for watching and goodbye.